Welcome to week two. In previous week, we discussed how to define a test case in general and what the test case fields would be needed to thoroughly and completely define a test case. In this week, we will take it a little further and go over different types of testing techniques and tests that are used to test software. Two of the key concepts for this week include black box versus white box testing and coverage testing. These concepts teach you how to approach testing and how to go about deciding what tests you need to have efficient test. We also go over the first two types of tests that are usually conducted, unit test and function test. Make sure to look carefully over the examples that are given for both. Next week, you will get to write your own unit test cases. Learning activities for this week include lecture document and a graded quiz. There are again a few discussion questions for you to answer and to engage with the other students. As before, you can also post your own topics and questions related to this week's topic. At the completion of this week, you'll have a good understanding of different testing activities that are done during a software development life cycle. What is meant by white box and black box testing and how it applies to unit and function tests and how to create an efficient test suite with test cases that cover the code according to the specified criteria. See you in the next video.